a tribute of sympathy to the defenders of glen linden by rev h h dugmore read for librivox .org by sonia a tribute of sympathy to the defenders of glen linden away 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 there are patriot voices calling glen linden's band holds the foe in hand though its watch-worn sons are falling away to the mountain glen where the war-whoop wild is yelling and the savage howls as he darkly scowls on the white man's flame-wrapped dwelling there is life-blood reeking there where our slaughtered friends are lying not boldly slain on the battle plain but each by his hearthstone dying away 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 to horse to rifle springing while the widows sigh and the orphans cry in our ears in our hearts are ringing they were dwelling in peaceful vales nor fear nor danger knowing midst their flocks spread wide over the mountain side and milk and honey flowing the vine and the fig trees cheer the cornfields waving gladness the shearers throng and the reaper's song left cause nor room for sadness there was childhood's guileless glee there was maiden beauty blooming there was ripe old age with its wisdom sage and its honour life perfuming and there were thankful hearts for peace and plenty given the voice of prayer ascended there and the song of praise to heaven and where are they now ah where there are homeless orphans weeping the widow's wail is on the gale the sire in his gore lies sleeping and are there dastard souls whose homes these homes were shielding who can coldly read while their brothers bleed nor aid nor pity yielding brand cowered on his brow right traitor on his bearing who views from afar our homestead war and basely shrinks from sharing to your arms to your arms away what cease from the strife no never till the neck of the foe to earth bent low we have conquered a peace forever rev h h dugmore eighteen fifty one end of poem this recording is in the public domain